pickle that's in a Whopper. <laughs> we probably should have figured this out before I, we I, got in the yeah. car. That's who's about to have the loudest one. Can you get off? Can I bite your Whopper? Mayonnaise all over your face. They're ten dollars. He ain't even fronting. I'm ready to square up with these squirrels. This is the ultimate marriage dynamic. Hello, you guys. Welcome back to another vlog. I am in such a good mood. I'm just so happy and chipper feeling. Um, because me and Tyler have officially like finalized what our first project is gonna be officially in the house and we're gonna start it today. So I'm actually going to be documenting like all of it, I think in like it, their own videos, like probably do like a series, but like I'm talking like we're building things, we're painting, um, picking up a fireplace tomorrow that I could, I could cry because I've always wanted a fireplace in my house. It's not, it's a like mantle with like the fireplace area like cut out of it, um, which I'm fine with because it's hot here 90% of the year anyway. I just really want the look of the mantle. So we're picking that up tomorrow. Um, our rug gets here tomorrow as well. So like little by little, a little bit of the living room is gonna start to get done. So I'm just so excited because we've been talking about it all morning and we're both just super, super excited. Um, so I think we're gonna start off with painting, but again, I'm going to put this all in its own videos. I ordered, I'm surprised that didn't come like separately packaged, but okay. I ordered the vest set, oh, so cute. The vest set and, um, wow, this is big. I had a feeling it was gonna be big. It's a size medium and I just got it in a medium because Linen, like you never want to get your true size in linen because it's always going to be tight. I always usually size up. I'm going to try it on for you guys just so we can see. And I will link it as well if it's available. I know I can at least shrink it a little bit. Mm, it's actually not too bad. I mean, it's not tight at all, but I kind of don't mind that. Like I'm, I'm cool with like a looser fit. So I got the vest and the pants, which I have these pants in. This color, the zebra, and regular like linen, and I love them. Let's see. It's a little bit loose. Uh, I can't my second, so. Okay. Um, what time do you think you'll be done? Like three, three thirty. Okay. Okay. See you later. Bye. Love you. Vest is a little bit big. I would definitely take it a little smaller. The pants are fine. I've tried these pants on a bajillion times. See, it's a little bit big like here, but I can definitely shrink this in the wash and I'm sure it'll fit perfect. My two other um, dining tables came. We just haven't built them yet, but here is how it looks. I love this with my black sandals. I just, I love it. I just have to get this. This has to be taken in just a little bit so that it, I don't look so boxy, but I think when I shrink it, it should be good and if not i can just take it to a tailor and have them just like take it in a little bit like here but overall i love this and this entire outfit 50 dollars. like how i don't know very 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 cute actually getting ready now because i'm gonna go to the hq because we got some new arrivals and i want to see them touch them package a couple of orders um and yeah try on the pieces and then later on we're gonna start Oof, I'm so itchy. I need to put on lotion. I get like crusty and dry. Wow, my lighting is so bad in here. Um, but yeah, I my mentality has like completely shifted to um, home, 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 home. And that's all I want to talk about and all I want to do and all I want to search on Pinterest. I'm putting on my nipple covers. I really need new ones. Like, look at these. I've had these for like maybe almost three years. I'm wearing the BC Body in dune my favorite and i'm just gonna keep these black linen pants on because they're comfortable and they're easy after i leave brendan's parents house i'm gonna go to Publix because we're out of like milk we're out we're about to be out of dish soap just like a couple things so I'm gonna do that just thinking about putting on makeup but like do i want to especially if we're gonna be like painting and stuff i don't really know I don't really know. I wet my hair a little bit, but I again didn't feel like redoing the whole thing. 
because again, we're going to be at least, I know we're definitely going to go to Home Depot. Um, I'm just going to put this clip in my hair, just clip it back, leave it like that. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to put makeup on because honestly, like, what's the point? <clears throat> um, but yeah, our, look at this guy. Our fireplace is going to basically be underneath the TV and then we're going to mount the TV up. Not sure if we're going to keep this TV like I had told you guys. Um, and I cannot wait to just get this started, but we're first going to paint this, which I think we're either going to do... We might start it today and then complete it tomorrow. I'm gonna try to do as much of it as I can tomorrow while Tyler is working. Then we're going to do crown molding on this wall. Like all the way along because it's a really, really long wall. I'm just so excited. I'm excited to finally like have the itch to start in the house because we were for so long just like focusing on the backyard, which I'm not mad at. Like I'm very happy we did because we have everything now for the summer. Putting on my Luxum filter. This is literally the best body cream ever. It's crazy because me and Tyler over all of these years, we've always talked that like we would love to buy houses and like redo them and like not necessarily flip them, but just like Tyler loves building things. Like you guys will see with all the projects that we end up doing, he's gonna probably do 99% of them himself because he loves that stuff. His biological father, which he doesn't know him, um, but what he remembers of him, he was a carpenter. And he's like, I'm pretty sure I got that from him because he just loves working with his hands and like always just wants tools. And I'm gonna get him a tool for his birthday. His birthday's on Monday. So I'm just really excited because this is something we've always wanted to do. Like he loves the building aspect and I love obviously the decorating and designing and sourcing and all that stuff. And I don't know if I showed you guys on the vlog but i got both of the ottomans which is going to be so pretty they saw the tags on them and everything and then i found this i did show you guys this already i'm just i'm really excited about that whole thing but i'm about to fill up my stanley real quick so that i can get going i need to grab my bag grab my laptop grab my charger grab all that stuff and then just head out of the door. Someone commented on my last video. My last video was 48 minutes saying that they want long videos again. And I'm like, bro, this video is 49 minutes or 48, 48 or 49. Um, so yeah, here's two long videos. You guys, today was such a bust. I'm already back home. I went all the way to Brendan's parents' house, which they live about 25 minutes away. Went all the way over there. I was gonna start packaging orders. And the box of items did not arrive yet. It said that it was out for delivery yesterday and then there was a delay. I checked and I was like, okay. So I went all the way over there for nothing. I am PMSing hard and I am in that mood that like I just want really yummy, cozy food and to be comfortable and to lay in bed. Hey you guys, I'm looking a mess, okay? I'm looking a mess and I don't care. Our rug just got here. You can't even see it. There it is. I haven't opened it yet. I just got home from the shop and I got my period last night. I slept horribly because there was basically a freaking hurricane in my side of town yesterday. And I was like texting everybody. Like I was texting my friends. I texted Brendolyn. I was texting my parents, like my sisters and it wasn't raining anywhere else. I was like, what the hell is going on? Like it was hailing my umbrella that I have in the backyard, the black one that is connected to a table. The entire thing went flying into the pool. Our fish pond was overflowing and Tyler had to run outside and start like bucketing water out because if not the fish were gonna come, it was a mess. And then the power went out. It was just so, so crazy. And when I went to sleep, I think it was like 1 a.m. and the fire alarm started like beeping, like going off. It would only beep like three or four times, like beep, 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 and then stop. And then finally when I would fall asleep, it would happen again. And it happened at 1 a.m., like 3.40 a.m., again at like 4 something, at 5 and at 6. And I was just like, oh my God. So these circles under my eyes. Hmm. And I got my period on top of that. So I was just like, yeah, no, this is, this is ghetto. But we have officially... <clears throat> let me 
build up our table and two of the chairs are not gonna be here but this is what it looks like with six I actually really like it I didn't know how I was gonna feel if I was gonna like six chairs but I like it today we're going to pick up our fireplace which i cannot wait we're going to start painting which i cannot wait all of that is going to be in um part of the series like the redoing the house series so that's all going to be in a separate video so just wait for those they're going to be coming like right away so you guys will see like a little snippet but when it comes to actually seeing all like everything getting done i'm going to put it in a whole series of us like literally doing every single project in the house and i'm so excited we have been we've been we've been dying to do this like tyler has always said he's like oh my god i can't wait when we get our house you can youtube all the projects and it'll be so cool for us to be able to look back on and see like where the house started and where like what we ended up turning it into so i'm about to jump in the shower because again i am hot my hair is crazy i got some mangoes from our tree they fell yesterday from the freaking storm that hit like a lot of mangoes and one thing i'm happy about from the rain the backyard is so lush everything is so green it looks so pretty my um i don't know the word it's a uh, star fruit carambola we have a carambola tree in the backyard and if you've never had star fruit we eat it all the time in puerto rico it's so good it's the one that like you cut it and it's in the shape of a star we have a tree and the tree is like exploding with tiny little carambolas i have to wait till they get big i opened up one of our mangoes the other day and i ate it and it was in incredible and i also ate two of our tomatoes and look we have another one they're i think are they grape or cherry i can't remember but they're so cute and then i have some mangoes here none of them are ready they're like really hard so but i wanted to grab them because these squirrels I'm ready to square up with these squirrels because there's so many mangoes on the floor and all of them have bites in them from the squirrels All right, so I just showered and got dressed. I'm wearing the Dune bodysuit again because I just love it and I'm about to I'm gonna open this bad boy up so it can start like laying flat. This is a almost a 9 by 12 i needed something very very big because our living room is pretty big and i just needed something big i just took two advils because i'm not trying to feel like shit all day are you so excited i just want to lay it out first for a while so it can like flatten out I don't even know. Ooh, I like the colors already. different than the other ones i wanted it because that teal color reminded me of that apartment in um, amsterdam that we stayed in so here it is it's huge i love the colors the fact that this was under 150 dollars yeah. for a rug this size it was on sale i'll leave it linked down below i'm not sure what it's priced at now but it is bit massive like huge and i'm so excited it looks darker on camera i feel like but there's like a really pretty like teal blue there's some like burgundy some like tannish gold cream yeah it's really 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 pretty colors what's up you guys so we're in the car i'm just waiting for tyler he's throwing something away um I'm so excited. We're about to go to Home Depot and I actually hate Home Depot. I don't know any woman that likes Home Depot. I just, I don't like Home Depot, but now that we're doing stuff for the house, I like it. Now you like Home Depot. You already knew what I was talking about. We're stopping for gas first, then we're going to Home Depot. What are we gonna get? We're gonna get paint? 
Do you know what paint that is that we have to get? You want to get that exact same color? Yeah. The exact. It's the color you want the entire house for. Well, what did you want to do? Simply white? Or like that linen, something like that, something in that family. I mean, we could try to grab a paint sample if you want. Hey, all right, hold on. You said I thought this entire time we were just getting. The I mean, we could do whatever we want, but I mean, yeah, we can do whatever we want. We can, you know, we can change it to. We can. We I'm probably should have figured this out before I, we I, got in the yeah. car. All this time, we've been saying we were just gonna paint the pink walls the same color as the rest of the walls. Now I don't know where he wants. He has not once said, let's change all the colors of the walls, which I'm not against, but this whole time we've been talking about painting the walls the same color as the rest of the walls. Like we probably should have landed on that before all of this. I just found something else on Facebook Marketplace and I hit up people two chairs for ten dollars two wood chairs with like leather like seats and tyler knows how to reupholster like he's reupholstered chairs before so he's like we can get those and reupholster them with like a cool fabric for the cocktail room how for ten dollars two chairs they're like lounge chairs too they're not like a regular chair so facebook marketplace for like woods um Definitely wood. Wood stuff is like the way to do it. I wouldn't get like a mattress or like things like that on Facebook Marketplace, but like wood things that like cabinetry, shelving, mirrors, tables, 100%. These are them. Halo. It's pretty much the fucking living color. <laughs> like, it's like, it's really light. Yeah. You said that's, it's called Pale Oak? Pale Oak by Benjamin Moore. By Benjamin Moore. The guy just wrote me back that the chairs are still available. Oh, you asked him for the chairs. I just asked if they were still available. Okay. They're $10 for two chairs. That's like nothing. Can't even get one chair for $10. Can't even get an arm for a chair for $10. Didn't get the cushion for $10. You can't even get to the store to buy them for ten dollars. I almost can't get to the store. Well, I guess. Here. I'm gonna close this. I just have to wait for this to dry. Yeah, that's fine. Mm -hmm. this <clears throat> wow. Well, let me find out. I'm gonna be on Facebook Marketplace all the time, just looking at stuff. And that girl that bought, remember the the girl that bought the uh, entertainment center from us that she came with her boyfriend yeah. to like load it up. So she's like, she just bought her house and it, I think it's like a condo. She's filling her, almost her entire house with like secondhand stuff. This girl has found, she found like a, like a chartreuse, like a yellowy green tufted suede couch. And she, the guy had it for 300, she offered 150 and he took it, he was like, sure. And she posted it, she was like, you know, I'm, I'm gonna clean it and all that. She's like, but this is like great condition and like every shelf, every lamp, everything in her house. She's like, I plan on airbnb this. So it's like, I don't really care about like getting all brand new stuff. She's like, you know, I wouldn't get like my mattress or anything, but she's like, I am trying to find as much as I can on Facebook Marketplace. So she kind of like, inspired me to like just look more and see what I vintage MCM wicker chairs like that's such a fucking cool chair it's not my vibe it's not like what I want in my house but look how cool these are sure Tyler's not into the yeah. he likes more modern stuff and I don't like modern stuff. Well, I do, I do, that's a lie. I like modern stuff. Um, I just don't like everything to look like a museum. Like, I don't like a super modern space. Oh my God, and then like, there's people that just give stuff away for free because they're just like moving and they just wanna get rid of stuff. Like, cool, cool stuff. These are the chairs. So it's like two wood accent chairs and they have leather seats so like you can change that to be whatever you want like that's so cool 
two for ten dollars two for ten dollars you guys like what i'm on his profile to see if there's anything else you know what we should do tomorrow we should go to um Fortuna. there's a puerto rican bakery literally right next to our house i've never had there before and the one that jeremy had bought that one time that you know bakery is around here too so tomorrow uh, you want to come with me and uh mikey to the gun show that's what you're doing tomorrow well for it's a right around here and we're gonna do it at some point yeah i have to tattoo tomorrow as well i thought you said you were off tomorrow i was but remember i rescheduled my appointment from yet a second appointment yeah, yeah. yesterday mm -hmm. so we could do what we're doing today yeah unfortunately my dad hate my dad throws everything away. My mom will try to save something and my dad will throw it away. I came out like him. I just throw shit away. I don't even care. Throw it away. No, you hoard things. No, I don't hoard anything. Decorations. No. Pillows. No. I don't hoard you can't hoard pillows. <laughs> when we have bins and bins and bins of pet just pillows. False. I'm glad you got the truck that you wanted. Like the way that it all happened, very seamless. Yeah. But what if the hot dog guy is outside? He's on the uploads. Oh. That's ghetto. I mean, we could hit Home Depot. Or we could go to Lowe's miles. instead. Take a slight right I mean, I'm not hungry. Drive. Well, look at that license plate. I've never eaten a Wawa so they're fucking good. Like I ain't even fronting. He ain't even fronting. I've had a Wawa quesadilla. Those are fire. Those are really good. I've had a regular good. Wawa sandwich. Breakfast and lunch. Well they be baking the bread and all that there too. So it's mm -hmm. all really good. Yeah, Wawa is definitely the superior gas station. There's a bakery, Puerto Rican bakery right Diamond there. Diamond Club. Oh, <laughs> your fave. All right. Who was it from? It was a, it was a Benjamin Blanche. Oh, yeah. We could find something similar, or they can paint match it, color match it just to that. True. Definitely lighter than it appears on the walls. I keep looking at this Roman plaster. Might be a little warmer. Here. So we have hit the paint. Yeah, I definitely want something like that. So now off to the wood trim. Trust me, you're not a woman, the so men you don't that are get in it. Here are here for that. They're not here. It's not here. Sure, you've never been a woman by yourself in a Home Depot. If, you don't even have to when be by yourself. When have you ever been a woman by yourself? That's what I'm saying. You don't even have to be by yourself. Molding. And you can't speak from an experience that you've never experienced. Look at all the oh, wow. little corner pieces and the texture. Fun. Yeah. Uh huh. I'm at Home Depot. I hate Home Depot. But we're here. Wow, and it's so cheap. A dollar? Like, obviously, you need a lot of them, but. I think that's my All these down here, the little sections. Let's see. Yeah, that's pretty. That's the girl that I. There's a girl that I follow that lives in New York that has. Um, her apartment, she did like all this shit too, and it looks so nice. I want something like this. One. Yeah, so we would have to do this. So. 
Huh? Yeah, we saw us on it right now. So we're at Burger King because Tyler wants something. I don't remember the last time. It's been a long time. I don't remember the last time. Before college. Burger. I'm not hungry, yeah, but right. chicken fries are always good. I love chicken fries. Thank you for just Burger King. How may I help you? Can I do a Whopper meal? A Whopper meal? Yep. What do you like for drinks? A Coke? Can I do that with cheese? Okay, a number one with cheese, with a Coke, and what else? Um, I'll do uh, chicken fries, and that's it. Chicken fries, and what else? And that's it. Any sauce? Ketchup. Oh, for the chicken fries. And uh, what, uh, yeah. What sauces do they have? What okay. sauce do you have? I have barbecue, honey mustard, chicken sauce, we're buying some buffalo. 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 Okay. That'll be it, thank you. Thank you. I guess I'm eating chicken fries. Do no need chicken fries. Do no necesitas. That's it. Why? Too many asses? It is a lot of asses. Yeah. It's almost like saying necessities. Necesitas. Do no necesitas. Say it, practice. There you go. Tu no necesitas. It means you don't need. And then you can say chicken fries. Tu no necesitas chicken fries. Tu no necesitas cafe. Tu no necesitas ice cream. Hello, 1485. Why? Because there was necesita. No necesita. Okay. <laughs> you don't need it. No mas. <laughs> I could have got the Spider Man burger that was dyed red. I looked at that <laughs> and I'm like, why? Who needs a burger that's dyed red? Our food's already. Since when do chicken fries come in a bag? That is absurdity. Starting route to home. Alright, I'm gonna try a chicken fry. They're good. They're crunchy. It's, it's like a skinny chicken yeah. nugget, yeah, but they're good. You want your fries? Your burger? Both. Can I bite your whopper? Sure. I just want the pickle. Mother, this is hot. Good. Wow. Oh my god. You're gonna like it because it's like hot. Well, hurry up and let me get it then. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Bro, the pickle that's in a whopper. Looks like I had to get the My Wife's Not Hungry special. With <clears throat> mayonnaise all over your face. This is the ultimate marriage dynamic. One of you, and he likes pickles. He just doesn't like pickles in his sandwiches. He likes pickles just like on their own. I like pickles in everything. On their own, on sandwiches, in burgers. With mayonnaise. And oh, a mayo pickle cheese. I used to eat these in high school all the time. I remember the first time I ever had an allergy that I realized I was allergic to penicillin. But you should probably know that. That's my husband. Yeah. Um, but it's not When I was like 17 or 18. Um, I had like, I was really, really sick. And my mom took me like to urgent care or whatever. There's another one. And they gave me something with penicillin in it. And my entire body broke out in hives. 
Um, my mom felt bad and got me Burger King because Burger King is directly in front of my mom's. And she got me chicken fries mm. ever since that day. I love chicken fries. I don't remember why I like, always like Burger King. The Whopper is fire. Well, they just put a lot of like big toppings. vegetables and yeah. shit on there. It's Lots like it of makes toppings. it juicy. Yeah. It makes it feel like it's like a burger from a barbecue rather than like a fast food burger because most fast food burgers don't have anything on them. Yeah. Like they're more plain. Alright. They're good. It's like a soggy french fry almost. But it shouldn't. They gave me ketchup. Is it a packet or is it like a packet? Okay. McDonald's has the best packet ketchup ever. McDonald's, ever. the little salt packets they used to have. Got two little mm -hmm. crack. Yeah, McDonald's, certain things, very specific things, are like superior at McDonald's. I like their ketchup. Same thing as like Pepsi from a Taco Bell. The best. And the, the lettuce from McDonald's, like the shredded lettuce in the burgers. Shred the chopped onions from McDonald's. The too. chopped onions in like the original cheeseburger are crap. And I don't get it. How do they chop them? Sis? So small. So small. That is honestly why I like my vegetables chopped up so small. And it's perfect because when you're eating them, you just get like a tiny little crunch. Whew. Full. Full? Careful. What? I'm banging shit all around in my car. You're throwing trash in your backseat. I'm not scratching nothing. There's lettuce on your chair, a french fried spit. Oh, that goes in here. Excuse well, me. Organic fish? No, I'm not. What's organic? The lettuce. Lettuce. <laughs> we don't want none of the organic shit. Don't look at me like that. I haven't even looked at you. you don't get that look up. I feel like you'd like that word in Spanish. Like if somebody has like a look, it's a mueca. Mueca. No, mueca. Mueca. Yeah. M-U-E-C-K. Mueca. Like stop making those muecas. It's like stop making these stupid faces. I don't know what it is in other Spanish, but in Puerto Rican anyway. For my birthday, we're going to do a big old burnout. out. On a serious note, do you want to do something on Saturday? Potentially. My problem is I keep just mentally putting all this off. And my birthday's in like three days. Right, and Saturday's tomorrow. So. Ah. <laughs> yeah, that's why I'm like, I keep asking you and you're just like, ah, whatever. I haven't thought about it. I'm like, yeah, but it's tomorrow. Like if you tell like Mikey, John... I guess everybody from the shop. Damn, that was bad like, timing that Damien left. Then. I know. It's like just having, like having your people. One good he would have been. He would have loved it. Mason, I don't know if he would come, but just like all your people. We well, have been at this light for a long time. Too long. I could bring out my caldero, the huge one. Scrape all that peg out. <laughs> I can make rice and something. I can make patelios. I can get little discs. Make Discos. Some, make some of those. Um, if this right lane opens up, I'm gonna do some NASCAR shit. So. Damn it. Oh, mother. <laughs> Ha, 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 ha.
That's just the V8 opening up, getting Careful. ready to go. Turn right onto gas <laughs> you guys. Did you feel it spin in the tires? Pucking them butt cheeks? Pucking? Puckering. Wait till I get an exhaust on here. It's fucking. Is that one of those loud things? Do <laughs> oh, not. You best believe. Dare. Oh, you best believe it's coming. I'm gonna put some test pipes on this thing and shoot flames out of it. Ba 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 ba. You know those loud cars that ba ba ba. Yeah, that I hate. Guess who's about to have the loudest one? To have eight cylinders. Ba 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 ba. It's gonna sound like a fucking machine gun. Da 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 da. Get the burbled. What? It's called the burble. Burble. Burbled. The pops and bangs. Oof, and especially when you start it, the startup tune. Yeah, I need that. Wake up all the neighbors pissing. You'll know when I'm home every day. Our wall is painted. Look at that. What a freaking difference. It's still drying, so it looks like a little bit blotchy, but it'll be fine once it completely dries. Um, we're about to go pick up our fireplace, and I am so excited i hope everything goes well and like i know there's a lot of like scams and stuff that can happen i'm just hoping everything goes the way it's supposed to go um i'm really really excited also oh yeah i showed you guys my rug already the rug opened up are you kidding me this is absolutely beautiful like right here look at the colors it's like a dark teal blue. I got it because this color reminded me of the Airbnb that we stayed at in Amsterdam the first time we went. There's like really pretty maroons. It's just so beautiful. I love the colors and I like that it's moody and dark and just like, I love it so much. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna take you with us when we go to pick up the fireplace and i'm gonna save us putting it up and like decorating and putting the rug down for the first um video of the series i recorded us painting and all that stuff um so yeah i'm so excited first project down a whole bunch more to go hey you guys so it's been a couple of days since i vlogged i think i last vlogged on saturday but um, I wanted to end this vlog with just like showing you guys a little update of the space. It's obviously nowhere near, nowhere near done. Um, but I got curtains in, so I figured I would show them to you guys. They're right here. Um, I have to get ready really quick because me and Tyler are gonna go do a couple things. like these <clears throat> so I ordered these to hang them these to put them on the rod they're like these brass aged brass um, clips and I was torn between black and this color but I got this color because there's already a lot of black metal and then here's the curtains I will leave them linked for you guys um i don't even remember what length i got but i'll leave it all these are perfect it came with two and i got these for the dining room so i might put these up today today's tyler's birthday so i'm not sure exactly like how much i'm gonna get done but i got that for there and that is gonna go here. I just put those up for now just to have something there, but as you can see, they don't reach all the way to the ground. I don't know if you're able to see right there. Um, and I want to lift the rod way higher, so I just got really, really long drapes. And then I need to get drapes for here, but I'm going to have to get like one, like a couple, like two packs. Um, but yeah, I am obsessed with the fireplace. I'm, I love it so much. Tyler has to mount the TV, but we have to get a tool first. 
um, and then we're actually going to do built-ins here, which that's gonna be another project that I put in the series. I just kinda wanted to show you guys the last of what we have. Um, like I said, it is nowhere near even remotely done. We have a lot of work to do, but this is just the update that I figured I would show you guys. I love the rug so much, like, love it. So yeah, um, I will see you guys in the next video.